like I'm a for real BBW. And it really hurts my heart to even say that. But I hate it. I don't want to be one. Hey y'all, welcome to, I guess this is like technically week one of my weight loss series vlog, um, trying to get my life together. Um, so the last vlog that you did see, I was saying in the last vlog that I wanted to include that clip with well, that day with these days, but that vlog was a little too long and I didn't want these vlogs to be over 45 minutes and child that one was already long so we're starting this week off again today is Monday July 4th happy July 4th to those who celebrate um and I am on my way to the gym I ate one piece of um raisin bread before I go to the gym I'm gonna drink this um, I have a half a scoop of pre-workout that I'm gonna drink real quick. I drink a protein shake. I am full. I am full. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, but I've been, um, like I was saying in the last vlog, I'm not getting my protein. Looks dark. I'm not getting enough protein in, and it's because I'm just like late on my meals. So <sighs> I drank that protein shake. Usually I wouldn't drink the protein shake that early. Um, especially because I'm not eating, I'm not um, having protein coffee anymore, <clears throat> like I used, like I used to. I might have to go back to that because that's how I was getting in my protein, ensuring that I was getting in protein. So yeah, I had a protein shake, um, eight ounces of egg whites, one scoop of protein powder. So so far, I have I think 49 grams of protein. So far. So that's better than um, I was yesterday at one o'clock with zero. So it's 10.55, I'm getting a late start already. Child, I've been up since 6 a.m. I could have been at the gym and back by now. But you know, I've been lollygagging. So let's go to the gym. have a um olaplex treatment on my hair olaplex number three um and it is a treatment you put on your hair before you wash it so i'm about to wash my hair when i get in the shower so 
that's why my hair looks like this don't mind that pay attention to what i'm about to say so i'm home um i made something to eat i'm gonna show you what i have and then we're gonna eat i was eating on some strawberries so was eating that while i was cooking but pretty much the meal that i'm about to show you is pretty much the same meal that i ate in the last video um a hodgepodge of things i cooked it and re re warmed it up in the on stove top it's just five ounces of ground turkey this time um i had some leftover broccoli i threw that in there leftover asparagus a half avocado one green onion six ounces of jasmine rice is in there five ounces of ground turkey um i'm gonna put some of this green dragon hot sauce on there and then so so far i have i use the carb manager app i just have it on low carb okay so i have consumed with um my protein shake and what else did i have this morning the protein shake well i can look the protein shake and the egg whites um, and then this meal, um, consumed 70, 77 grams of protein. And then this shows net carbs, but you can show the total carbs there. So I've had 71 carbs so far and that's with the bread. This is a, a app that people use for keto, but I just use it because I mean, I'm so used to using it, but, um, I'm going to stay under 100 carbs today because you know, low carb things plus i did upper body today so i don't really need a lot of carbs so um this is pretty much the only carbs that i'm gonna have today good morning you guys it is tuesday and i'm just having a, a rough start i'm on my way to the office and somebody keeps texting me and i'm gonna have to turn my phone on mute you know somebody will start the day off just texting 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 and you just don't want to talk like you just not in the mood. Well, that's what's going on, girl. I don't feel like it. I'm just putting my water in my cup, my gallon. Sometimes I fill this all the way up. Sometimes I don't. I put a liquid IV in here. Yesterday after I showed you guys what I ate, I literally kind of just sat around. My knees started bothering me yesterday. It's hurting today. I massaged my legs out with the massage gun that I have. Um, I had to put the knee tape on because somehow, some way, my knee is twisted again and I'm so frustrated with it. It's just like, it's not as bad, bad as it was two weeks ago, but it is twisted. So I put the knee tape on it today. So I don't have to wear my knee brace to work. I do have my knee brace just in case it does get bad and I don't have to throw it on. Um, it's in my car actually. So um, I had to sit on myself because I was so frustrated just by, see, what, what, ah, uh, um, because sometimes I'm like, feel like I'm so in a rush sometimes, but I'm not in a rush, but my mind is in a rush. And I had to center myself because Anitra stubbed, I stubbed my toe and that like set, set I stubbed my toe, broke my toenail. Ugh, that made me mad. I can never go have a, a nice pedicure without stubbing my toe, ever. It's always, I always break it. Anyway, I broke my toenail right now. And then I'm grabbing everything. I grab my phone. It falls out of my hand. I grab this. It falls out of my hand. I grab something else. It falls out of my hand. I literally had to center myself because I felt like I was about to start bursting out in tears. So, I had to like... <sighs> you can't cry over this. You cannot cry over this, Anitra. So, let me take my allergy medicine. I take Flonase if you're curious. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I got to put this on mute already. Because, Cal, I can't be bothered. I am going into this day. I'm going to put you right here and see if this lighting is better. Hold on a little bit. I am going into today. I got a head wrap on. Going into today. Not prepared at all. Um, I'm going to get lunch out. I already know where I'm going to go. I'm going to have a salad from somewhere. gonna get a salad 
I don't have time to make me anything to eat. I don't have time to make any type of coffee. So, oh, here's my stuff. Thought I had left this in my gym bag, but so y'all, I love this lip stuff. Lip Glowy Balm by Laneige. Anyway, I came to this place called um, Juan Pollo, and they still pretty much sell rotisserie chickens and things of that nature, child. So usually if I, if I come here, I will get like chicken, chicken, um, and sometimes I'll just get the chicken. Sometimes they sell potato salad, I don't eat potato salad, but they sell rice, beans. It's almost like El Pollo Loco, but like a thousand times better. They have two tacos, they have all kinds of stuff, but I've been getting their salad. They usually put tomatoes on here, but I asked them not to put the tomatoes on here because I take them off anyway. So it's going to look real plain. But it's nothing but chicken, cheese, and salad. But like I said, usually there's tomatoes on top, but it's pretty much chicken, salad, and it's a huge salad. And it's just chopped up rotisserie on top. It's going to give you a lot of rotisserie. It's down there in there deep. So they give you salsa. I don't put salsa on my salads, but I do take this salsa home, child, and I use it on different stuff. They ask you if you want ranch or Italian. I always get Italian. I don't eat ranch on my um, salads, so no for me. And then we got a fork, and I usually take this back to my job and eat at my desk. But it's too much going on here today. I just came. So here is the salad so mmm and it's so simple you guys but it's so good to me I don't like my salad with a whole bunch of stuff anyway I'm a plain Jane talking to me. Mm -hmm. See my problem is you guys I could already feel it. After I eat this I'm gonna want something <laughs> I'm gonna want something sweet. And I brought cherries. They're at my desk and that I, I can tell you right now that's like not the something sweet I want. I want like Snicker bar okay let's be real honest right now I want Snicker bar but I'm not gonna have it. But that's what I want. Maybe I should stop and give me some gum. I just have to stay the course. I want something sweet though. I wish you could buy like, I wish you were able to buy like mini you know how they sell the bag of minis, like mini Snickers and things like that? I don't trust myself buying those bags because I know me. But I wish you could go in the store and buy the minis, like separately minis, like maybe like 10 cents or whatever. 
because I, I could do that. But me buying a mini, the bag of minis, and trusting myself to like eat one or two is an absolute no because I know myself and I'd eat like 10 of them mugs. <laughs> and <laughs> that's all bad, girl. <laughs> Like, what's the even point? <laughs> you might as well buy bought a king size snicker, girl. So, you've been better off. Thursday. It is Thursday. What's today's date? July 7th. Let's talk about yesterday at work. This next week coming up, I'm definitely going to prep some meat or meals for work because I literally did not set myself up for greatness. You guys, I, I cannot continue to just buy food out. For one, for money purposes. Like, Eating out is, is expensive, and although, yeah, you got the money, like, who wants to spend money on food every time they go to work? And then, so, Tuesday, you guys saw what I ate for lunch. I talked about eating something sweet. I did not eat something sweet. Thank God I had some cherries, so I ate those cherries yesterday. And Wednesday, I didn't go to the gym because I just want to get all my sleep so I don't have to worry about because I just have not been able to get back into the groove of going to the gym before I actually go into the office. So I want to get all my sleep, okay? So I don't go to the gym on the days I have to go into the office. I just don't. I haven't gotten there yet. I, I, the pandemic has ruined that groove for me. Yesterday was supposed to be like a very low carb day. Um, 50 to 100 carbs. Oh, I'm sorry about this lighting. I think it's because I have a hat on. Um, and Anitra took herself to Jersey Mike's and I was like, well, I'm gonna get a sub in a tub. No, no, wanna, got a sandwich, got a sandwich, got some Doritos, the Cool Ranch, and got a cookie. Didn't get a drink though, could have my water. This is still my water from yesterday. So when I tell you I did not do good yesterday, I did not do good yesterday. What did I eat for dinner? Um, when I got home, I had a, some watermelon, um, I had some cherries, I had um, some pecans, because I have some pecans that I got from um, Costco. I was just like snacking on different things. I had some of these because my son had these. I had some of these. I didn't, like, I didn't have like a real meal. Didn't have real meal. Um, my eggs, I had the sandwich and stuff for lunch, and then I kind of like snacked on different fruits and stuff. And that, them Ritz. What, what was that? That's not low carb, Nitra. That is not low carb. I didn't even log it. I can tell you that's probably over 200 carbs. I don't know. I can log it and, and try to figure it out. But <sighs> one day is not going to set me back. But I cannot have multiple days like that. You know, that's just not good. That's not, that does not, it does not go with the goals that I have for my life. Okay, so today's a new day. It is very early in the morning. I'm very sleepy right now. I actually want to still be in my bed, but I'm up, okay? I'm up, we're gonna to go to the gym. My knee actually feels so much better, thank you, Jesus. Okay, I don't know, it, it, it wasn't as bad as the last time I twisted it. So, it's back, but I'm not doing legs today. I'm gonna give it another day of rest, and I'm gonna do shoulders, I'm gonna do chest, and triceps. I'm trying to drink this. I don't like this protein at all. This flavor is so disgusting. But I'm trying to be I'm trying to use it up before I buy more. Because it got to go. It got to go. And it's too powdery. The protein that I like, the thymatize, it don't do all of this. Like, you see how it's all over my fingers. And it don't, my, the one I like don't do all this. It's not messy like this. This is a messy protein. I don't like it. Yuck. So my son re-upped on pre-workout because I said I wasn't going to. He bought the same brand that I was buying. This one is the ACG3 Supercharged High Voltage Pre-Workout. This one is in the gummy bear flavor. I only took a half a scoop. 
BCAAs are by Metabolic Nutrition, Tri Prep, Tri Pep. I do not switch on this one. This one is my favorite. It tastes, tastes the best. It does not taste artificial. It just tastes like grape soda. I like the taste of grape. So, this is why I continue to buy this one. I only buy the grape. The grape only. Really see where did I miss? Mm. Junior wants to not be your mind. 
Um, two eggs. I did measure my cheese because I'm so used to measuring my cheese. It's 24 grams of cheese, two eggs, two pieces of turkey bacon, one mango. I did make another protein shake, and that's just some more water. Um, so, so far, um, I think, let me see how much protein I've had and how many carbs I've had for the day. So far, I've had 120 grams of protein and 13 carbs for the day. And the carbs are pretty much from the, um, well, because I've measured the cheese and the protein powder. So, there you go. So, yeah. So far, so good. I'm doing good so far. So, um, I kind of wanted some coffee, but I don't have enough coffee grounds. I was going to make a matcha, but I don't feel like it. So... I don't need no more caffeine because I feel like I'm almost about to crash from that um, half a scoop of of, of um, pre-workout that I have. I'm sleepy and I don't know if it's just because I just got up early. Anyway, let me eat because I need to start work. Brandy got to make it hot, L L. Cool J got to make it hot, uh -huh.
hot. I was in that dang on sprouts. I was trying to run in and out of there. Let me tell you something. I have like, I have my mask on, but people were, people love talking to me. I don't know what it is. People love talking to me. They love talking to me. <laughs> just in there ch chatting it up, girl. Just chatting it up. I was grabbing some things and the lady was like, you got it? And I'm like, yeah, no, I'm good. And she started talking about some random stuff. I'm over there looking for something else. The lady told me to wash my purse, which I appreciate her for that. Because my purse was literally just open. And I'm over here, la. And then we start talking about some other stuff. And then I'm looking at something else. And the lady came up to me, started talking to me about other things. And people, I don't know what it is. They love to talk to me. I, it's just like everywhere I go. And I appreciate that because I'm going to be honest with you. The way, and I have my mask on. And that's probably... Don't come out your place. What it is. But because usually I have a arresting bitch face. And I kind of have oh, tried to not have it. Because at the end of the day, that's not like, you know, people that have arresting bitch face. That's not like who you really are, right? You're really not trying to be a bitch. That's not what you're trying. You really not even paying too much attention you just minding your own business right the people have always told me that i'm just not a very approachable person those broncos are so nice they have come back with a vengeance baby those broncos are bad are bad anyway um it makes me feel like damn people can't talk to me so anyway where else can I get together um, now, um, but you know what, on the flip side of that, the people that have always talked to me, no matter what, no matter what, are old people and children. They are always the ones that will talk to me. <laughs> they, they talk. They love to talk to me. But now, I've, um, I always try to work on my face because, you know, you, uh, it, listen, I'm not going to be trying to walk around just smiling and cheesing for nothing now. That's just not who I am. I, I, I ain't about to be walking around just smiling. But I try to make my face like a little more presentable. Unless I just ain't in the mood. But as I've gotten older, I just noticed, I don't know if it's just the, I don't know, presence or whatever. I have no clue. But people literally come talk to me and they will tell me all of their business. And I be like... I, it, it surprises me every single time. Every single time. Uh, every single time. But, yeah. Crazy, right? So here's the thing. Before I go home, I want to give me some food, right? Because I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm starving right now. But it's like, okay, I want some food food. Like, I don't want, I don't want nothing baked, grilled. I don't want nothing that, I don't want nothing from home. I don't want, I'm going to be honest. I don't want nothing from home. So, I was like, okay, there's a habit right here. But the thing about this habit, the parking lot is crazy. And now it's starting, everything's starting to open. Which means everybody's here at this point. It's still very early, but everything's starting to open and everybody and their mama is out. I don't get the summertime when everybody's just, I don't get it. Um, so the habit's right here. I have to find a park if I want something from the habit. Cause they have no drive through, okay? The place I don't have to find a parking spot for is Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A, I don't have to find a parking spot. And I'm gonna, I already put the, I'm gonna just uh, gave it to me. Okay, there we go. Carbs at 110. That's more like it. 
Okay, so my total carbs after this meal be, will be 110. That is good. Okay, let me, let me, let me add this meal. The poor children of Chick-fil-A that work there. It's crowded in there. It's crowded in there. It's crowded out there. Oh, child, listen. I hope the guy that's handing out the orders right now, they don't need to have him right here. He's a young man. And it's, it seems like it's a very easy job. But I told him, you don't need, they don't need to have you right here. They don't need to have you right here. They don't need to have you right here. That's probably not the nicest thing to say. But he was just like, he was getting very flustered. And I was flustered with him because I feel bad for the children of Chick-fil-A. All they need is their little summer money. And they stressing him out. It was 50 million orders up there. And 50 million drinks. Crazy. Hey guys, let me show you what I got from Sprouts really quickly. I actually went in there for some egg whites. So I picked up two of the egg whites. Um, I saw these. I've never saw, never seen these before. Um, but Enlightened has cookies. So um, 100 calories per cookie. Let's look at the macros. 100 calorie per cookie, 7 grams of fat, uh, 14 total carbs, 6 fiber, uh, to protein so it's two net carbs per cookie so I guess that's with the sugar alcohols and all the rest of the stuff so I'm excited to taste those I guess you bake them so that'll that'll be good so I'm excited I got some lemons for my juice I picked up some new Celsius flavors this one is peach mango I got two of those because these were three for five so I got two peach mango and then I got a grape rush. I got some stride beef bit long. I got two of those. And then I did get some of the Terra chips that um, have the regular sea salt. I do like these. So I picked up a bag of those. And I've never seen these before. I love fried zucchini. So I'm like, well, maybe these are like a better alternative, but it looks like these are with breadcrumbs. So maybe not, girl. Maybe these is the same. But they have quinoa. Hmm. We shall see. Hopefully they taste good. But asparagus fries. Um, let's, let's see what the macros are. Five pieces. Child, I don't think I'll be eating five. But for five pieces, 90 calories. Um, 1.5 fat, 17 total carbs, 9 fiber, 2 sugar, 4 protein. And I got two of those. And then I got some um, nectarine. Like donuts some peach ne nectarines not peaches nectarines and then they came in this little thing and that's all i got from sprouts i was gonna go to trader joe's but <sighs> excuse me i took my head off i didn't have the energy i didn't have the energy so trader joe's is gonna have to wait for another day so i'm about to eat my um chick-fil-a actually i'm kind of full because i was eating on the fries um who knows how I'm eat the burger right now. The burger will get eaten. Probably right. Not right now. Though. But. Let's show you. I just got the regular burger. With uh, the regular Chick-fil-A burger. With uh, no cheese. Just the regular burger. So yeah girl. Let me go ahead and put this stuff away so I can shower and so I can like chill so I shower the
So this is a homemade ice pack that I made out of water and alcohol. So it gets slushy, but it doesn't um it doesn't freeze solid, so it does melt, but I just put it on my knees and then once it starts melting, I'll put it back in the freezer. So you see these scars. This is just random. I got these scars on my legs, right? I'm like, how did I get these burns, right? It's from that ice pack. I just freaking realized it. <laughs> I have to put something on my leg before I put that ice pack. It literally freezer burned me. So I had like, it. they looked like, you remember when you were a kid and you like, um, went down the stairs and or you, your your sibling like dragged you and you got carpet burn it was like that and that's what it turned into I scar really easily easily whether I pick a scar pick pick it I scar so I've never picked that off it just scarred so let me go get a towel because I just realized it like dawned on me right now when I took that ice pack off all this was like really light and I was like wait a minute okay so there's a tip if you do this make sure you put a towel don't be like me and put this on your bare skin okay I want to show you guys what I made for dinner um, this is New York steak strip or strip steak um, five ounces and then some broccoli that I steamed and I put some lemon pepper garlic powder and I put some I can't believe it's not butter on it. I'm gonna eat that and go to sleep. You guys, I am so tired. I am so sleepy. Done. Literally done for the day. So, um, you know when you work out and you feel the workout the same day? I my legs are like wrecked. I am tired, so. I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna go to sleep. Oh, you guys, these these um, nectarines I got from Sprouts, I ate a couple today. They are so good. So, um, if you have a Sprouts or if you see the donut nectarines, get them, like at any store. They are good, they are sweet, ugh. They are divine. Good morning, you guys. Happy Sunday. It is Sunday, July 10th. Excuse my morning voice. I did just wake up. Of course, I've washed my face and all that, but I just wanted to talk to you before we end the vlog. So I weighed myself today. Let's see. Let me tell you. Let me tell you what I weighed in at. Today I weighed in at 263, 263 pounds. Can I talk? 263.4, which means I gained 0.2. So I mean that I am maintaining. Now, Am I upset about that? No. Do I think I really still weigh 263? Mm, yes and no. Yes, because in my mind, I'm like, well, maybe the Chick-fil-A and maybe the Jersey Mike's has me maintaining, right? But then I'm like, no, because I know that I did the work. Like, I know that those two sandwiches did not set me back to maintain 263. But then I'm like, well, Anitra, you're not really tracking. You're only tracking your carbs and your protein. But then... <coughs> These are the things that go through my mind. Then I'm like, well, those things were tracked, you know? So, I'm like, ham, what am I doing here? So, my body is sore. That's another thing. On Friday, when I went to the gym, I did legs. My bet, my legs are, my, my whole body is sore today. Usually today, Sunday, I would go and do legs, and it's like the start of my workout week, right? But I'm changing my workout split this week. So I'm changing when I go and what I do because I want to start really working out for my body type. I'm sorry. I have my, um, I just showered and changed into more. Why is people, no, I'm not joining a, y'all, people really be texting me early in the morning and trying to group FaceTime me early in the morning. I don't get, <coughs> leave me alone. Um, 
Um, what was I saying? Child, see that made me lose my train of thought. What was I saying? <laughs> oh, what I'm saying. I really want to start working out and eating for my body type. I am an endomorph body type and I really want to start doing that. So I'm changing my workout split this week and I'm going to start doing that. Um, also in my next vlog, so you'll see that, you'll see I'm going to try something that I said I wasn't going to try. I'm trying that this week to see if that helps with weight loss. Um, and then we will go from there. So every week, um... Well, just was just a trial and error because girl I have to get this weight down I gotta get it down so yeah 263.4 um I am not upset oh what I was saying about the, the the workout about my legs so my legs are so sore my body my legs are inflamed I can tell that they are inflamed. if you don't know like when you work out for example like I worked out my legs and my legs are really really sore right now they are inflamed they can get inflamed and you know inflammation causes water now i'm not saying that that can cause a uh, weight gain or maintain it but it, it's it can so my legs are hurting like to the point where like you walking and your legs give out on you my legs hurt so that could be it as well so who knows i'm not sad about me uh up 0.4 or me maintaining the weight for the week because i know that i did the work me eating a chick-fil-a sandwich and fries and me eating jersey mike's that one day did not set me back i'm not gonna claim that it did i'm not gonna receive that it did because um life is not perfect like i know that i'm gonna i know that i'm going to have days where i'm not going to eat great every day like it's life like and I don't know who has perfect life and who eats perfect every day. I don't know that person. If you are that person, girl, give me the tips, please, because I don't have them. I don't got it in me. But anyway, I'm going to let y'all go because it is Sunday. I'm going to start a new vlog today. If you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching. If you made it this far, because I, I, this video is longer than I wanted, to, wanted it to be. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. If you are returning thank you for watching if you are new here and you have subscribed to my channel thank you for subscribing if you are new here and this is your first time watching my name is anitra if you like this video go ahead and subscribe like the video go ahead and comment below say hey i do say hey back um but i'm going to let you guys go and i will see you next week and next week's vlog bye you guys take care